kind of like bedtime. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Welcome to day three. That's actually gone quick. Three days. Oh, and my door just knocked. <laughs> she knocked a little while ago. I'm not too happy with breakfast this morning, so I'm going to actually... Breakfast this morning is... It sounds so fussy, but... I mean, I don't really... Actually, I might have a little bit. <laughs> no, I don't really like fruit in the morning. Well, let me try a little bit. Let me try a little bit. It's not bad. But I think what I might do... I don't really like fruit in the morning. It finishes the whole thing. <laughs> I'm actually sleeping in a lot more. I did go to bed a bit later last night. But about midnight, I woke up 7.30, so it's a good seven hours. That's good. I'm going to try and get at least seven hours a night, plus a little nap in the day. Because when else can you nap in the day? And be like, cool, I don't have anything else to do. I'm just going to have a nap in the day. So, mm, I'm going to do a lot of study today. That is what I need to do. I might actually start my day with a bike ride as well. God, I want to do everything at once. I just spoke for so long, realised my camera wasn't on. Coffee's not as good today. Different barista. Or a different kind of coffee. Um, so, I think it's going to keep asking for a large. I had toast left over from yesterday, so I've just got a slice of toast, my coffee, and um, yeah. All is good. It's going to be very hard. Oh, God. <laughs> no, yeah. That's hard, all right. <laughs> I've showered. I've put my jumper on backwards. But, hey, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because no one's going to see me. <laughs> Um, so now I'm just going to do my skincare. I'm going to put some makeup on again because I like doing that. Um, and then what I thought I would do, sorry, again, I've got the TV on loud. Hold on. So on today's agenda, a little bit of, uh, Charlotte Tilbury's magic cream. Let's see what magic it's going to do to my face. Um, and then what I thought I'd do is change this room around a bit and i need to ring up and see what i do with like all the rubbish because like there's a lot of rubbish in here um and i just want to keep it as sort of tidy as i can and then i'm going to change the room around because i kind of want one big bed i don't know i don't know if i'm allowed to do that but as long as i guess i put it back at the end should be all good no right i'm gonna put a bit of foundation on might put a little bit of no nah, i won't put eyeliner on today will i i don't know maybe this actually is a foundation this is what is it trini london bff serum what is that called best friend forever serum no bff serum de-stress well, let's have a look if it works. I've had magic cream on and now de-stressing foundation. Should have the perfect day, shouldn't I then? Lovely day again out there. Tell you what, this is the middle of winter for Perth. Absolutely mad. <sighs> Hair and makeup is done. Let's go over here because it's much better lighting. A lot of you also said about, um, in my last vlog, the dirty windows. Now, it's not actually dirty from the inside. I want to point that out. It is just from the outside. So I guess it's really hard to, this is on the 10th floor. So to come up here every day and wash these windows would be a mission. So in their defense, it is on the outside and we are near water, which means there's a lot of what do you call it? Wind backwash. Oh, that's what you get when you drink something backwash. Anyway, um, so yeah, it's not that bad. Um, and also in terms of the food, everyone's like, oh, it's so bad. To be fair, I just want to point out they aren't treating me bad. Okay. 
So, um, it, I mean, it is, it's just a hard thing to, to have to do to anyone to stay in a hotel for 14 days. I, I think it's sensible, really. Like, if I was to leave here, imagine, and then I went and saw my nan, I'd never forgive myself. So in, um, in many ways, I think 14 days is sensible. Yes, it's hard. Like, I'm not going to lie. If you are planning to do something like this, I think you really need to... Um, you really need to realize that the 14 days in a room, it's intense. Like it, it, it is something you're not used to doing. Um, even when we've had lockdowns, you know, in London, you're still able to go out for your one hour walk a day, which does keep you like that. That's a huge thing that keeps you feeling, uh, good. Or you can go out and sit on your balcony or you can at least open the front door <laughs> here. You can't. So it is hard, but do you know what? They're doing all they can to protect everyone in Perth. And I kind of, I'm, I'm, I, I'm okay with that. I think, you know, it's my choice to fly here. Uh, I knew the, I knew this is what was going to have to happen. So it's all good. And I don't want to make out like the hotel is bad because it's not, it's really not. And they do like, you know, they send you food and you've got the option to be able to order something else. It's fine, like I've got my exercise bike. I've got some weights coming today, I think. Can't wait for that knock on the door. Anyway, I think I came on here to say, I just rang up to see about the cleaning situation. So when I first got here, when I was very emotional, um, I didn't even realize, but I've got this, I've got so many brown paper bags in here. This brown paper bag has your essentials in it. So it's got some little cleaning up wipes I've got some black bin liners toilet paper and tissues so um oh and these red bags so i just said about changing my sheets i'm going to change my sheets today. i'm going to do a little clean up and they're going to send drop off some cleaning products to me i'm going to put all my sheets and towels in here uh, i'm going to get rid of all my rubbish put that in the in the bags and then um should have a nice spick and span room. So that's what's gonna keep me entertained this morning. And I'm so excited to clean. <laughs> actually, genuinely, like when I'm at home, I actually love cleaning as well. So uh, yeah, and I'm gonna see, like my brother, my brother's really busy. Everyone's like, get your brother to send you this, that and the other. My brother works like nine till nine, especially on Monday and Tuesday. So I think Wednesdays, he's got a half a day. So he may be able to drop something off to me. We'll see. I did ask him for some dark chocolate and some oats because breakfast for me is very important. Um, and I don't want to keep eating toast. I want to, although I did eat that fruit this morning and I didn't mind it. It's quite refreshing. Let's get cleaning. Put my stones on the windowsill. Silf, silf. Get them recharged. Actually, it's probably better over here and gets more sun. So yeah, got me stones. So I'm changing rooms. Well, changing the beds around. And I've come to a little halt because what I was gonna do is put both beds over there. So I've got like one giant bed. How cool would that have been? But we've come to a halt because this thing that stops it in the middle is like connected down here. There's like this big wire that you cannot take out. Like that would be bad. I would be paying a lot more for my room than I bargained for <laughs> because I'd have to fix it. So um, I'm just gonna push this bed over here like this. So we have that. And then I'm thinking I can do my yogi here near the window. I think bike that I think all oh, that can probably hmm. quite hard to change this room around, isn't it? I think I've got a plan. I might start sleeping there, and this can be my day bed. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to start to sleep in this bed. And then this is going to be my little day bed where I can sit this way like that. That's cute. That's really cute. It's cozy. Love that. Okay. So what I've done 
is I've flipped the bed the other way. So that's now my day bed and that's my actual sleeping bed. Good idea, right? Might as well use both of them up. <clears throat> Sick, happy with that. Right, knock on the door. I think it's a lot of cleaning products. This is exciting guys. I have some packages that have come from Amazon that I've ordered myself. So what have we got? See, this is fun. I feel like today I'm also gonna do an ASOS shop. <laughs> just because I think I deserve it. 14 days in here, I deserve it. Nice, I've got eye drops because when I was on the plane, my eyes got super sensitive. Oh, I've got an air purifier. I'm so excited to put that on. And you're shitting me. You're actually shitting me. This cost me $30 and I've got the wrong, I'm fuming. So I got this color conditioner. <laughs> oh, I could have sworn I put orange in. It's purple. That's, I'm fuming about that. I'm actually fuming. But hey, if you don't laugh, you'll cry. So, oh my God, I can't believe I've done that. I can't believe I've done that. What's this one though? Oh, this might be my oats. Yes. And this. Porridge sachets. Oh my God, am I happy to see those. Natural five grain and super seed. This is exciting, guys. I got me breakfast. Look at that, that's nice. Little sachet, source of protein, good source of fiber. Fruit free, no added sugar, very high in whole grain. Oh, hang on. Ooh. You can either do it. Oh, that's awkward. You either do it in your microwave or on the stove. I'm sure if you just put hot water in, it'll be fine. That'll be fine. Oh, I love that. Fuming about that, because that looks like a really good conditioner to put color in your hair. Vibrant color deepens with each wash. Oh, I'm so annoyed. <laughs> bed changing time got my new sheets and i'm gonna change this bed that i've been sleeping in cue lovely music My dad just called me uh, on the actual phone of the hotel because I can't get receive calls on this phone, I think, because it's obviously an, a UK number. Um, and he was like, oh, so do they give you the, the newspaper daily? I was like, no, dad, no newspaper. He goes, oh, my God, father, I wouldn't survive. What about radio? Have you got a radio? <laughs> I was like, it's all right, dad. I've got my laptop and I've got my phone. I think I'll be all right. <laughs> I love that though. Like that is just the generation of my dad. If you, are you able to get the newspaper? It's very refreshing, isn't it? Um, so yeah, I just thought that story was quite cute. All right, my room is tidy. I'm actually laughing at myself because I've literally just done a TikTok that just cracks me up. Like it's, re it's actually TikTok. For these kind of things, honestly, I, I like TikTok anyway, but it keeps me so entertained. So I'm going to post that soon. So if you're watching this and you haven't watched my TikTok or you don't follow me on TikTok, go follow me on TikTok and have a look. It's just stupid, just stupidness, really. Uh, hence why I've got changed for the TikTok. Oh my God, I'm just silly. I'm... Anyway, I've had another knock at the door. I think it might be lunch. I don't even know what time it is. I think 12-ish. 
which is kind of cool. That's gone quick, hasn't it? Morning into the lunchtime, so let's have a look what we've got. Oh. All my rubbish is still outside the door. It's awkward. Uh, right, it is lunch. What is on the lunch agenda? I, I ordered a juice as well from... Um, it's not Deliveroo, from Menu Log. Menu Log. Oh, they love their Fanta, don't they? Oh, this is amazing. I've got sushi. Oh, now that, that is lush. I am well excited for that. Oh, guys, I'm going to enjoy my sushi. I don't, I'm just, that's just brilliant. Brilliant. I really felt like that. Nice one. Thank you to the team. And I love a bit of seaweed. So I'm going to sit at my nicely clean desk with all my vitamins. <laughs> um, and I'm going to enjoy some sushi. The time has come in the day where I've actually, I kind of got a bit like, eh, sat on the bed for a bit, had my sushi, which was really good. Um, and now I'm going to do a bike ride. 45 mins, if I'm feeling good. I should be getting weights today, actually. I might have to message him and see what is going on there because they haven't arrived. But yeah, let's do this. Oi, I just did my 45 minute spin. <sighs> I did much better than yesterday. Yesterday I could only do 15 minutes at a time. I am like sweating a lot, but I don't feel as like claustrophobic today. I am watching as well while I'm doing it. So I did like a, the Peloton nap again. But while I'm doing it, I'm watching some like scary shark movie just when i feel like i want to get into the ocean in australia but to be fair apparently it's quite cold out there today but it doesn't look good does it i mean we are the middle of winter so that's pretty mad like how good is that weather for the middle of winter right i am done on the bike i am going to do some abs now a bit of strength and then and then i don't know <laughs> I want to do some yoga again today. I did some yoga yesterday just for myself, but I do want to do some yoga, um, some buzz wellness stuff. So I would love to do a live buzz wellness here at some point. If you guys want to join me, let me know in the comment section if that's something you'd be interested in. I'd have to work out the times because obviously it'll be like a, I think an evening uh, for me, but yeah, it'll probably be morning for you so i'll have to work that out but that would be quite nice another quick little bike ride i'm becoming obsessed with bike riding um <laughs> i'm the reason i'm doing it because i've already done my kind of workout but the reason i'm doing it is because i'm just so cold <laughs> it's gone from one extreme to the other look at me i've got two jumpers on my long pants and i'm just i just feel really cold so so if I get on here, it'll warm my uh, body up a little bit. Um, but I have had, okay, so I had at all. Oh, that might be dinner. That might be dinner. Every time I'm on here, I get a little knock, a little cheeky knock. It doesn't happen that often. I'll have a look what that is in a second. Well, when I warm up. Oh, I spoke with my therapist, um, which I think was much needed today but she said so this is what i'm going to try and do right i'm going to do it in it's called chunking down time so instead of thinking of 12 days i'm thinking of three consecutive days in a row and then not only am i chunking down the the day so i've got i've already done my first chunk of three my next chunk of three and then i've got what three six nine twelve <laughs> So another three chunks of three. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but basically chunking it down into, it's quite common sense really, but it is easy to just be like, oh, I'm gonna think of um, 
tw uh, 14 days in a row instead of thinking of just three days. When you think of three days, it's nowhere near as bad as thinking of 14. See what I'm saying? And then same goes with the day, chunk it down into times. So think of this is what we're gonna do in the morning, the middle of the day, and then the evening. And before you know it, day's finito. Do you know what I'm saying? So yeah, anyway. Might have a bath tonight. I'm a bit funny about baths in hotels. Always have been. Never really feel quite the same as sitting in your own bath. Because I kind of think other bums have sat on that. But I guess it's the same with the toilet, isn't it? Oh my God, that is the same with the toilet. Other butts have sat on the toilet. And we just go and sit where other butts have sat. That's so true. Because I told my brother, because he was like, have a bath. I was like, I'm a bit funny with the bath. And even he said, that's weird. Is it weird or... Does that, anyone else feel that? I'm getting warmer, thank God. Um, is it weird? I don't know. I'm not quite sure. All right, guys. I'm going to do a couple more minutes on this. And then we'll show you my dinner. I think it's my dinner anyway. It's an early one tonight. It's like 5.30. What we got? See those kettles were still out there. All right, that's the dessert. That looks actually nice. Don't know what that is. What's on the menu? Okay, had my shower, fresh as a daisy. I'm cold again though, so I've put my pajamas on with my jumper. I'm probably gonna leave the vlog there because I'm gonna start to wind down now for the night and I've got to edit this whole video. So I'm gonna do that and hopefully get this out today. Thanks for keeping um, me company. I love that you love watching what I get up to in this hotel room, which is really not that much. So thanks for that. And thanks for all the support. Everyone's been so supportive, which is brilliant. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.